Our Kitsugeta today is Bianca. This is probably gonna be like the best game today. I'm just that cool. So like, I'm talking to someone, right? You just got Yeah, man. He didn't like how I was dancing with her. I really like having Angela as my main. Hi guys, we're currently at Willow Park. We're gonna be getting ready to get started with our dances that we are doing for Alfredo's birthday party, which is when? Tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> this is the surprise dance of the century. Like, We're ready to surprise him tomorrow, right? Yeah. I'm like, I turned off my location. Oh wait, I have mine still on. I want him to see that his boys care about him like outside of work and that we'll take the time to make this special moment for him so Alfredo can have a little wow face on his face. Medway! <laughs> Bro! Oh! I've been seeing you forever, bro! <laughs> we got Medway back! <laughs> it was the best thing, because I feel like Medwin was like the first guy that I like really connected with when I first got here. So it was really nice seeing him again and, you know, having him part of the dance as well. Yo, I don't, I don't even know how to dance anymore, bro. Okay, bro. <laughs> Reuniting with Medwin was one of the most special moments to me because we came in together and auditioned together and me and Medwin have always just been like this. Like, me and Medwin, it was me and Medwin against the world. Once an AC boy, always an AC boy. And I'll never forget any of the moments. And reuniting with Medwin was just honestly everything. Like, I saw him with like the biggest smile on my face. Like, I loved every second of it. Go <laughs> dance with his tongue out like a dog. <laughs> <laughs> My vision was, bitch, we're gonna shake ass. <laughs> this is, hold on. Let me just play it. Let me, this is my vision, okay? Okay, go. Call us over. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> now. We obviously want it to be funny, but just something that, you know, Alfredo will remember. The first night and now, we're going like this, around. Okay? okay. Or we can do what, whatever you guys want, like this. I think. No, 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 no. We can cover our face, or we. We can, yeah, we, can, we can do a shower. Yeah, so. Like, na, 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 Okay. Like that. He still got the AC boy in him. Eric. Eric, I don't think that looks good. Not to kill the movie. This is how we're all turning our backs towards the No, we didn't have to do that. Okay, well, I think after your shower, look forward. Yeah. Or should we go down? Or how about you guys go down? And then he goes down, and then I do it, and then on the little da -da 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 -da, then you guys get up. Or like, you can be like, da -da 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 -da, and we'll all get up. We'll be like, da -da 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 -da. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, open clap. One, two, seven, eight. It was just nice to be able to like give our own ideas and about a dance and stuff like that, and like being able to mess around with Alfredo telling us to, you know, get back on the job and stuff like that. But we still got it done, and I think we did a good, pretty good job. <laughs> I am excited yeah. and nervous and scared. So I sent invitations out and kind of lose count. But then people bring their own people, so I think over a hundred in this in this backyard. I want to have fun. I want to enjoy. I want to party. Enjoy my family, my friends, people I haven't seen in forever. We have of course AC boys coming today. I think Diego and his family are coming. George. Eric, I'm not their boss today. <laughs> I'm not their boss today. I want them to have fun and enjoy with me, but not too much, because some of them got work tomorrow. We have a grupo, we have a DJ, we have nacho, like everything, everything you would see at a Mexican party. I just want a good vibe. I want everyone to have fun. No one's sitting down. If you're sitting down, like leave, respectfully. My DJ is Ricky Rage. I love the way Ricky was engaged with us. Like, he was dancing with us. He was getting the party started. And it says, Shoddy Fredo. I'm crying. I'm so Seeing the outcome, like, so many people showed up, I was like, people I don't even know showed up. Like, I don't know how that happened. Like, que se oiga ese aplauso para Alfredo, por favor. All of a sudden, I hear the DJ announce my name, and I'm like, what could possibly be happening? Like, <laughs> flash mob. That's the first thing that came to my head. Oh my God. <laughs> 
when did they have time to do this? We're booked, you're busy, like when did you guys have time to do this? My favorite part was Medwin comes and sits next to me and tells me, what's going on? I love seeing like my techniques in there. They've learned from me, you know, like they pay attention to the choreos we do. Like that was really, really cool to see. Alfredo has changed most of our lives and I feel like he's done so much for us. So this is the least we can do for him. It was so beautiful to see like Aaron I love and like Aaron that supports me and like Aaron just together one. Like this community has been the best part of my life and really hard work. Like I miss it. Definitely, definitely a good birthday party. Hi guys! Hey Bianca! How are you guys? Good. good. You saw me Why? literally a couple of times. Like, like... Dirty look on you. <laughs> Do you need to go outside? Do you need to go outside? Damn. I don't know what is up with you right now, but we're gonna no. have a problem. All right, go to the beginning. Okay. <laughs> My God. Yeah, go teach. Yeah, y'all right. heard. I don't know what's up with JJ. I don't know if he had a bad day. I don't know if like he's going through something, and I feel like maybe I need to communicate with him a lot more to see what's going on. So we start this dance on the floor. So go, get on the floor. Turn your leg. That's what I have to do. And JJ, you hear my nerves. And then go like this. And then stand up, and then spin, and then bow, and then walk up, right? Since you know the dance so much, how about you do it? Go, take over. He was very much talking back. And if you don't want to be here, you don't have to be here. Doors open. I feel like I make the practices better, but at the same time, I can be a little stupid. That's just me, I'm myself. I'm JJ. Boom, and boom, two, three. Let's fix this, Bianca. So hand's gonna go straight up like this, by your ear, and you're gonna go. Jeez. There you go, yeah, because up here it looks like, Looks Wait. funny. Yeah. So okay. And then spots go. Spots five, six, five, six, triple go. One. Our get together today is Bianca. Bianca has the best personality ever, has this amazing vibe. The day I met her, I was like, this girl's skin is gonna be insane. One thing, when you guys are dancing, y'all look like this. Y'all look yeah, drunk. Yeah. Add, add, add more of a movement. Five and six and seven and eight. Boom. And in dip. No, it was oh, dip. Yeah, dip. Dip more, Bianca. Okay. Go for it. Ready? This is probably gonna be like the best game set um, that you guys will ever see because I'm, I'm just that girl. Like. And then when you walk, you know, give me, give me a little diva moment over here. Can we? Ooh! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Can we all agree that Bianca is a bad bitch? <laughs> beep. Oh my. And I had to beep that. I'm definitely gonna pop off on my quince. Like everyone's gonna be shocked. I just know it. Most girls that I've like got to quince to, like some of them don't know how to dance. That kind of like bugs me sometimes because it's your day. Like you wanna pop off. You'll need to show off. Boys go from dun 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 Ready? I gave her the song sky full of stars and she fell in love with it because her middle name is cielo meaning sky five six seven eight because you get lost in the more dun, 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 to angela once a girl knows exactly what they want and like they're very confident about it it love you 
Thank you. Thank you for making my job easy. Give me movement. Go back. Dance. Don't just walk. After every quinceanera, I try to make my waltz better than the last one. I feel like this new song that was fresh, never taught before, love the beats, know the meaning of it. I felt so much inspired. Five, six, seven, eight, go. Walk, walk. And you're just giving me those arms. Yes, go back. Was I not doing that? No, you weren't. All right. Can you put a smile on your face, please? Sure. Ready? Five, six, sure? Yeah. Okay, ready? He was very much talking back. I was not dealing with it. I was already annoyed. Five, six, seven, eight. One and two. You keep going like this. This isn't walking. That's just stepping. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three. Nope, do it again. And five, six, seven, go. One, two, three, four. Go again. Are you okay? Like, actually? No, like, for are you okay? Oh. Damn. Yeah, we can play around, be cool with each other, but like in front of a client and like dragging it, like, you know, like I usually give them the face like, five, six, seven, look, right leg, left leg. You gotta walk the whole time. Try it again, ready? Five, six, seven, go. One, two, three, four. JJ, I'm gonna put a dog behind you to chase you, cause you gotta <laughs> run up there. Okay, but. Go again. I'm gonna stand right behind you. You're not ready? No, why not? Cause you're yelling at me. I feel like the most frustrating part is that I don't want to come off rude and call the boys out in front of a client because I know that embarrasses them. And five, six, seven, big. One, two, three, four, go. Five, six, seven, and eight. Thank you, that's exactly what I need. If I tell a boy, you need to like get your shit together in front of a client, you know, that's not professional. Like it looks like the boys are just here to play. Hey, you this dance is stressing me out. No, you're good. Oh, it's okay. It's fun messing around, messing with him, but then sometimes I get scared because he gets too serious and that scares me. And one, two, turn around, face the front. That's easy. Yeah, like, <laughs> no, you were screaming at me. That's not nice. I was about to cry. Honestly, Alfredo, like, I love him. He's a good guy. He's helped me with a lot. I had like a couple of deep conversations with him. I just felt safe talking to him and telling him how I feel about certain things. So it really felt nice that I know that he's a person I can go and talk to if I ever need anything. Spin. Da, 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 da. Go walk, 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 walk. Now go back, slide all the way to the front, Bianca, all the way to the front. Da, da, da. Bend this arm behind your back. You're gonna break your hand like that. Oh my gosh. <laughs> She's like, <laughs> Look, let me step in. Angela's one of our newer AC boys. He's been with us for, I'm gonna say like five months already. He's proven to me that like he could be a main, he's a leader. Let's go from this fast part. Go over your helicopter really fast. Boys, five, six, seven, eight, one. Wait, am I two, three, left? Four. No, JJ, you're on the All right. Left. Right. Oh, shit. <laughs> that was so weird. Okay. Ready? Hold on, hold on. Wait, start from over there. Start from over there. So we get a like. Uh, okay. Ready? Go. One. Go. Six, seven, go. One, two. I They both like the same style. I think they look perfect together. One, two, three, four. Yeah, it sounds like you're slacking in front. That was, that was good. good. That was yeah. Good. yeah. <laughs> So my name's Angelo, I'm 16 years old, and I'm an AC boy. I saw her walk in, and she was wearing like an area jacket, and I was like, oh, she can dance. Mom really liked him as my main, because like, he dances good, like, he knows how to work with someone, like, as a partner. I really like having Angelo as my main. At first I was nervous, because I'm like, oh, I'm the main. It's a tough job, because you literally have to be perfect. So you make your night perfect. I was stressed, and like, am I going to be the right fit for her, or not? My mom did think that um, something would happen between me and Angelo because like, she doesn't know I have a shoddy. Okay, so like, I'm talking to someone, right? And I told him, like, oh, like, I have practice like, today and it's like two hours. He's like, why so long? And I was like, oh, like... He was questioning? Yeah. And he was like, you're like dancing with someone, obviously. I'm like, obviously. And he's all like, wait, do you like... Grab him and shit. Like, like, yeah, like so obviously, like I have to, you know, yeah. like he's house, lifting me up and everything. In. He was all like, oh, okay. And I was like, yeah. 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 What did you say? 
Huh? I told him to not worry. Yeah. Like, so go from here. Obviously. I'm like, oh, I want to get the cheese man. Yeah. What? Wow, you said <laughs> no, we you talked, we talked We talked about her little boo thing. He got jealous because he didn't like how I was dancing with her. My shawty right now, he doesn't like it. Like, he doesn't like the idea of me, like another boy having hands on my body. When I told him that I was going to come today, he got like all mad and like, uh, I also like, fool, like, you don't have to worry about that shit, like, chill. Seven, and he eight, got all mad at like, five, I was like, they keep it professional seven, either way, you know? Five, Boys. It is what it is. <laughs> Any girls can dance with anyone who they want, even if they're in a relationship, because it's just dancing. At the end of the day, this is their moment to shine. This is their moment they've been waiting forever. And if these boys are going to add the cherry on top to that, be happy. I think it's a red flag because dancing is just dancing. It's part of a job. And I think she does deserve a little, a better boot thing. Like that doesn't get jealous that much. Guys, I just got to Eric's football game and I have anxiety to go back to my school. I'm here with the baddest and the shoddy. Oh, I'm so ready to see like that bitch perform. Like Today we're here at my old high school to watch Eric potentially be crowned homecoming king. And I'm just so excited and nervous to be back because this is literally my hometown, my childhood. Pretty girls walk like this, this. Walking back into my old high school. No, bitch, I have anxiety. <laughs> bitch, I'm scared. I'm like, the cops are here. Maybe. And like half Maybe. of my cousins come here too. Are you serious? Oh my God, guys, hide me. <laughs> <laughs> Walk like a bad bitch. bitch. Shoulders up. Shoulder up. Going back to like my past just bring back so much anxiety and especially like being where I'm at now and like going back to that is kind of just like people know me, people know what I do. You want to support the business stuff? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, thank you. Oh, thank you. Thank I you. Nice you. to see you again. Oh, yeah. Wait, so I don't get the pin? <laughs> of course. Can you take a picture? Just being appreciated by everyone there, like people were mentioning me, people were calling me, asking for pictures, and like that kind of just made me happy. We are in. If the phone's a little shaky, it's because I'm a little nervous. Hi guys. But Eric's right there. Yes, Eric! Oh my god, this is so cute! I'm like, I made that. I made that for him. Ah, we ate with the team. <laughs> She's all like, Psh. you know who wants to be an AC boy? This this guy right here. Where? The cheerleader right here. His name at is end? George. At yeah. I'm like, George, there, there might be another George on the team. Oh, how do you know he wants to join? He told me last time I came. Ah, he's all like, how do you know? Yeah. I'm like, there could not be one George on the team, so let's see who takes Sorry it. About it. I don't know if y'all will see me at auditions. Oh, okay. Go, Eric! Hey! Hey! Want a maroon and why you don't want one? You yo and if you want some maroon and why come man get some yo Eric? <laughs> I didn't catch it. <laughs> Bitch, that's it. <laughs> I love you. It's about to be halftime. Guys, we're, I'm so excited. We're, we're, we're about to find Hi. out who is the Hoko King. Tonight, we will present Homecoming for Husband of Are you proud of him? She can remember. And she hopes to achieve it. I'm going to cry. Let's go, let's go. The 2023 Homecoming oh, King oh. is. When I first met Eric, I was like 12, 13, and Eric was a big supporter of me. He would always make me edit. He would always like be so supportive about me dancing. Like it just makes me so emotional, so happy that like I can be this role model and mentor for someone. And I feel like Eric deserves this moment because like he's gone through so much growing up and like I feel like me and him share the same past. It's so pretty to see someone bloom. You can be whoever you want to be and you know like he, he's just the definition of like bad bitch. Oh, I'm so proud of him. How do you feel? I feel great. I feel very proud of Eric. And I, I know how happy he is right now. Like what about you? He's yeah. come a long way. He's had his struggles, but he's thriving and I'm happy. I'm happy and proud of him. I knew my boy had it in the bag. I am so proud of Eric. Look at him. 
Look at our king over there. I'm like, he's gonna wear that that crown to every king so he goes through now. <laughs> So guys, let me tell you why I'm stressed. I'm stressed because one of our boys is sick and he can't make it today and today's the last practice. Bianca! I got here and Jesus was not even gonna come. What's going on? Like it's my last practice. I need to like practice with all of them. Like how am I gonna do it? George, he's going in the party bus. <laughs> Bye, George. I'll see you soon. Yeah. Bye. Bye. Nice meeting you. I know, me too. Bye. You, you and George are invited to my party, so you guys better pull up. Yes. I'm sending on my right now. <laughs> I chose AC15 because I know George from school, so I told him, I was like, I'm looking for Chambelanes. Like, he helped me, like, text um, Alfredo. And it all just came together. If it were my kids, I wouldn't let him in my party. Oh this. my. I really thought he was gonna be in my court, but someone thought that he wouldn't be the right fit for my court. Why not? I don't think he deserves to be thrown in it. I just don't want George to feel like just because it's his friend's kids that he's automatically gonna be guaranteed a spot. Who would you throw in? If Jesus were to be able to come. I'd do it. I'd do it. I'd do yeah. it. I'd literally do it. I would I wouldn't mind, because Alfredo's like a George really or me. George or me. You. Sorry, George. Bye. We're just besties like that. Huh. Sorry, George. I have to take him from you. If I would have George to replace Jesus, honestly I don't know what I would think about it because Yes, George is my friend and everything, but I feel like George wasn't meant to be in my court. Oh, the boys are here. I tried finding some sweatpants, but this is the closest thing I have. So today is Bianca's last practice, and definitely my expectations for today are kind of just run through the dances, like no stress, just review the dances one by one. Do it again, and I better see no mistakes. Bianca, you did awesome. Thank you. We haven't had a practice for Bianca in about two weeks, and reason being is I was out of town working for Quinceañera, but these boys did not have no events throughout that whole time. I really hope you guys went over that surprise dance. It's not showing up in the in the walls right now, and it's low-key annoying because you guys had two weeks off, you guys didn't have no quince this past week, you guys had a whole week off, like, you guys could have gone over this, and I asked you guys to go over it. I don't know, maybe we need another round of auditions coming soon. Turn to the waltz. You only have one key to focus on, which is Bianca's. Watch the videos, study, know exactly what you're doing, and you'll be set. Go again. All right. So my expectation is really high. Like, watch that video, study it, practice on your free time, make it happen. No, they didn't do that. They didn't. Show me that ending. Show me that ending, the cross, ready? Do it again. All right, do it again from the top. Go, hurry up. Are you sure we all have it now? Yep. Yes. <laughs> Wrong leg, JJ. Wrong knee. It's 6.40. It shouldn't take us 40 minutes to go over a dance you learned a month ago. You have three minutes to figure that ending out. Three minutes, go. Figure that ending out. So you're going slide, slide, and then we're adding the pivot again. Pivot and then break. I've been lucky enough to, you know, be a part of this quince as my last quince because like the two or three quinces before were supposed to be my last ones, but this is finally, officially the last one. Just tap, cross, open, tap. This is Diego's last practice as an AC boy. Over time, I got really close to Diego, business-wise, personal-wise. Like, I feel like it was just so pretty to see like my seeds grow up. Done. Spot. One, two, three, four. I didn't want to take away from the moment that this was the last practice, so we had to like lock in and make sure everything's okay for the day up. All right, show me your surprise dance. For my sorpresa, I pictured 
Guapango, Zapateado, kind of tribal in between. Seven, go, sube, sube, sube la mano, sube, sube, sube la mano, sube, sube, sube la mano, tan, tan, tan. Cool. That's the type of music that I'm listening to right now. I'm really good at dancing any type of music, but those I feel like are more for like, oh my God, like a surprise, like the boys know how to do it, so I was super excited. Bianca Surprise Dance eats. It is her style, and I feel like our boys have been waiting for this quinta. Like, they've been waiting for this type of surprise dance. They've been waiting for this vibe. Bianca just being so engaged and involved and happy with it, like, made everything better. I'd like to thank all my clients for challenging me to be better. And she definitely challenged me with, with all her dances. <laughs> <laughs> How do you feel? Your quince is in three days. I feel excited for the party, but like I normally miss this place like a lot. It was something really magical with these boys like um, Alfredo, the AC boys. They really have a really special place in my heart. I don't know why I really like this like studio. It's like really pretty. And the boys obviously like... Um, We're pretty too. Yeah. We're pretty. You're pretty. You're pretty. Okay. I'm pretty. Oh, sure. Sure. like the prettiest one here. Sure. Well, the first I practice, think... you told us you had a boo. Yeah. Do you still have a boo right now? Mm -hmm. Damn. But he's not going to the party. Why? Because I don't want to say. Damn. She said she don't like you. <laughs> Flag on the play. Oh. Unnecessary relationship, sportsman conduct. Did you even invite him? Damn. Damn. Now that's crazy. She said she don't love I told you. Them about it, man. Yeah, it's definitely a red flag because I feel like you should be happy for your significant other if they're happy, right? Honestly, no. Because I wouldn't want Mia dancing with no other guy, honestly. Yeah. <laughs> we got bothered that, like, obviously I was dancing with Angelo and he was all like, well, like, why is he grabbing you? And I'm all like, how else, how else are we supposed to dance? Like, Wait, so he's not happy you're having a quince? No, like he's not happy with being here, like. So he's gonna be happy he doesn't go to your quince? I'm out of here. This is too much. Like y'all, I'm done. Go back to school, please. I uh, good night. I I quit. Good night. I'm done. Woo! Natalie. And Emma. Natalie. I like her pantuflas. Oh, I miss you. Today we're working on our, on our campaign shoot, dance. Compared to last year, I just felt so much inspired this year to invest more time, effort, like just within the whole production. My expectations for like this whole campaign art is just you have to like go above and beyond. Like you have to try extra harder. You have to like, your confidence has to be out of this room because this is what we're showcasing for next year, you know? The whole vision why we have like a little girl and like, a, like her sister and all that in there so girls can relate to this. I feel like a lot of girls weren't able to relate to Forever and Ever because it was just a video. It was just a dance. But this one, there's a storyline. There's like a vision. So I feel like girls her age already thinking about her quinceanera. There's like girls older than her that already think about her quinceanera. And when they look at Natalie, when they look at you guys, they can be like, I can be like that. You know, like I want to be like that when I grow up, you know? I I don't want just a boring dance. A boring dance is kind of just like, we just got together, we danced and all that. Like there's a storyline to it, there's a, there's a message. I know we grew a lot this year, like we gotta keep that growth going next year. So show me how much you wanna grow next year. And remember, there's auditions at the beginning of next year, so. Uh, I'm not auditioning. And that's the team. <laughs> <laughs> you'll yeah. be canceled so, by then. <laughs> just keep that in I'm mind. I'm like, I'ma skip that audition. <laughs> I'm more detailed and more, I have higher expectations for the boys during a campaign practice because a campaign is going to promote what we offer, right? Five, six, seven, go. Dun, dun, boom. Okay, how does that work? It goes one, two, lean. Da, da, hu. Ready? Five, six, seven, eight. Da, da, hu. And then? arm and then turn dun, 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 dun. it's the future it's the future of ac boys it's the future of ac 15 choreography your movement own it i feel like i always say this own your movement look let's put natalie on the spot for example you think when she walks around school she just walks like no i'm not she's no, that, she's, she's, that she's, bitch. She's, she's a bad bitch she's a right. model so she's gonna show that off you guys are dancers i always tell the boys are you rented boys or are you regular boys Prove it to me, like dance like your rented boys, right? Five, six, seven, go, my head. Pause. Now, this is not cute. It should be sharp and boom, yeah? 
feel the rhythm. Like, give me confidence. Ready, five, six, seven, go. Head and boom. You're still giving me like this little, tiny, tiny, cute little thing, Jose. You're going like this. You have to give me sharp. Like, what's up, bro? I think it's because I'm talking about clothes. Ready, and five, six, seven, go. Head and boom and slide. Show me the slide, because some of y'all be cheating this slide. Five, six, seven, go, and slide, and up. Try it again, ready? Man, I'm gonna break my knee one day. When I see these boys sliding on the floor, doing like knee spins or like stuff like you would see in a surprise dance in a waltz, that just tells the person that's watching. Those are hired boys, those are professional boys, right? It goes in my head. Your soul is telling me it's hard. Well, if you throw yourself on your knee, you're gonna break your knee. They're going, they're going too slow, so I don't wanna like- There go my pants. I do think like this campaign is a lot harder than like the first campaign that I did with Alfredo, but like, he's very strict on like your techniques and like straight hands and I don't think he's stressed, but who knows what he'd be feeling. I'm definitely the reason why I'm stressed. <laughs> it's definitely me. Three, five, six, seven, go. Everything is fine. Oh, one more time, get lower. I know y'all can bend your knees. Stop being lazy, get down. Five, six, seven, eight. Everything is fine. Thank you, now we're dancing. Yeah, don't be lazy. Try it again. Seven, go, and one, oh. and... <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I wanna be the best. I wanna be the best, and I really like just wanna be out there and really make sure that like people know who we are. And I'm the type of person that I'm never satisfied with what I do because I want more. Won't be waiting. Won't be waiting on the other side. Dun, dun, dun. Try that, ready? Why is he low-key a singer? Won't be waiting. All right, never mind. Didn't you want to be a singer? I don't acknowledge myself and my work and what I do as much as I should. And when people tell me that they're proud of me, it makes me cry because I don't tell myself that often, which I should. I'm gonna cry now. And one, and two. I like that, but we're just sliding there. Remember, that has to be a out, in, out, in. Try it again. There's a pause, like, out and ka, out and ka. Five, six, seven, go. Out and ka, out and ka. Try it again. That's confusing. What's confusing? I was doing this? Yeah, look, do it again. I'll help you. Go, and go. Hold up, go. can I have my hand placement? Six, seven, go. One and two and three and four. Look, you gotta go like this. Lunch with me, lunch, lunch, and in, and lunch, and in. There is a platform out there that we have, like we need to use it really good. And you know, try to just put out the best campaign for the next year and I mean, I'm very excited. It's challenging, definitely. Good morning, guys. We just got to um, Bianca's church. I'm not in this quinta, but I'm here supporting these boys. I have a lot to say about this, actually. <laughs> I'm the one that brought the client in. I'm the one that told her about us, so I'm just confused and she knew of us because of me. <laughs> I chose AC15 because I know George from school. I really thought he was gonna be in my court, but why not? I don't think he deserves to be thrown in it. I just don't want George to feel like just because it's his friend's kitchen, he's automatically going to be guaranteed a spot. George or me? George or me? You. Sorry, George. Bye. Look at them. They look so cute. Look at her. She's here. She's here. The queen has them. Bianca, you look good. My role is to be a good friend for her and be there for her if she ever if she needs something. I'm there for her. Like all I was asked to do was take care of social media and to make TikToks. Guys, I didn't sleep today. Cause he balled out yesterday. Yeah, but I'm tired. We're done with church. Uh, I think we're gonna go to the park to take pictures. So we'll keep you guys updated. Today is my last game says in AC Boy. Over time I got really close to Diego, business wise, personal wise. Like I feel like it was just so pretty to see like my seeds grow up. A lot of emotions, you know, in my head right now, but I want to, you know, complete the job first and then we can, you know, reflect on everything. Like, I'm actually so excited to see these boys dance because, like, I'm not dancing. I'm not a part of them today. I'm there as, like, a guest, so... Are you ready? I'm ready, yes. Are you ready? Not today. <laughs> So today's Bianca's Ski Today and I'm so excited for today because it's like 
a start of a new era within AC Boys within like this whole new chapter of choreography and everything. The boys are off with Bianca all day, church party bus, and I tell them, I'll just meet you guys at, at the venue. We are taking pictures at the park. Bianca is actually over there. You guys taking her, her photos. <laughs> George, the manager today. Even though he wasn't working for AC Boys, he was still working like within AC15. I had him do a social media. I'm excited to see how he does that way, like outside of this whole like AC Boys. No, keep going. Uh, Go. Oops. Wait, no, don't hold the time. Don't hold the time. Like that. Have it down. Okay. Are you up there? The struggle of filming content. George is a social media manager, and I would make fun of him. I'd be like, manager, and he would always get mad. He would be like, don't call me that, don't call me that. <laughs> yes, yes, <laughs> okay, yes. I'm honestly scared for the party bus because. <laughs> I think it was a little too good for some of my chambelanes. I had never like seen that side of the boys, obviously, and like they haven't seen that side of me either. So seeing that side of like like some of my chambelanes, I was like, whoa. They were all over the place. Too much glitter everywhere. The boys were covered in glitter. The glitter just stayed on them, like on their face, their hair, like glitter was everywhere. I mean, When we got off of the party bus, my dad's boss, he came up to me and he was all like, oh, like I got here and like you guys are still in the party bus. And I was like, oh yeah. And he was all like, oh yeah, the party bus was just going up and down. And I was all like. How are we feeling today? Uh, good, but a little things hurt, but I'll be fine. Can you still go full out dancing? Yeah, I'll try. I'll try my best. My football boys are Angelo and JJ, and I decided to surprise Angelo and JJ at their football game. I hang out with George a lot, I hang out with Diego a lot. Like, let me go show JJ and Angelo that I love them so much too. Let me go support them on something they love doing. Yes! Yes, JJ! I'm with George sitting in the stands, and George decides to say, what would you do if like one of your boys got hurt right now? When I see him getting like carried off the field, that was my last shot. I'm like, what the f And then he started crying. And I was like, no, why me? Why me? Why me? Why me? I'm just scared that like, you know, if he's hurt, how is he gonna be able to go on the floor, knee spin, roll, spin, like do all this crazy stuff? This dance is made for them, like no one else. Like, you were chosen for this container for a reason. They were making me mad. We were trying to make TikToks like Alfredo asked you to, and these kids were not listening to me. And everyone was calling me manager. I was like, stop calling we me manager. Listening, these are our manager. I, was, I was like, everyone stop calling me manager. That makes me mad. He's our manager now. <laughs> no, no, definitely not. What's making me really nervous is that everyone's gonna be recording. Like I haven't seen my family like in a long time either. So they're gonna like see me like in a big dress. They're gonna see like a whole new side of me, like a different side that they haven't seen. All the tables in my like, like venue were filled up. I did feel really like loved and like happy and excited to see all of my family. Everyone was like, oh my god, like you look so pretty. Like having everyone that I love in like one place is really like special to me. So it was definitely a good experience. She looks amazing. She looks beautiful. I don't think we need auditions. You know what I think he needs to do? I think he needs to man up, and if he thinks one of the boys is not good enough, then he should just kick them off. But I don't think there's need for... Bro, why is Diego calling me? <laughs> what? I miss you. I miss you more, Diego. I miss you more. Tell JJ I miss him. JJ said he misses you. <laughs> How's your knee feeling? Bro, how is your voice lost? <laughs> I take back what I said, guys. I don't think Alfredo needs to man up. I just think there's better ways he can do these auditions. Oh, he's behind you. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> it's 
Today is Bianca's skin today, and I'm so excited for today because it's the start of a new era within AC Boys, within like this whole new chapter of choreography and everything. Fredo, the AC Boys, they really have a really special place in my heart. They really changed how I see things in life. Oh my God, I'm crying already. <laughs> They're probably like the best court that I could ever ask for. They're like really special. They all know how to party. They all know how to talk. It's something that a lot of boys don't know how to do. <laughs> We have this group of boys coming from so many different areas, different backgrounds. So when our boys are very open with like who they really are and like, it just makes the clients like, oh, then like I can be like that too. You know, like I can open up. Perfect. And the boys, let's have you all like just looking at Bianca. Mm. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what? They did it too at that park and I was like, oh my God. It's just so pretty to see how like, we all just connect on a different level. Oh. I bought him this, then I bought him this. I made a quick stop at Target. Aww. The day before her quince out of football game and I honestly don't think they should have kept me in for that long. I was already getting tackled and then other people started coming and then I hit my knee. I wanted to cry because I was like, I can't get hurt. I got something to do tomorrow. It's important. Can you still go full out dancing? Yeah, I'll try. Yeah, I'll try my best. I'm just scared that like, you know, if he's hurt, how is he going to be able to go on the floor, knee spin, roll, spin, like do all this crazy stuff? This dance is made for them, like no one else. Like, you were chosen for this container for a reason. Can we do it with and without? Yeah. Yes. Is this is okay? I think the adrenaline is fed up. Oh my god. It hurts, I'll put it like right here. Oh, you wanted the container? No, but I think they put it on wrong. No, they put it on too tight. My crinolina is super tight on me. I literally cannot breathe. How do you feel? You're, you guys are enough. I'm about to work with it. Yeah, I don't think it was too crazy. Just be confident with it. Yeah? Pero, can we try it one more time? Yeah, can we try it? Yeah. But can you tie up the, the back? I do not want her to move. And I needed her to be poofy, to be giving. Like, I needed her to show off. It's really tight and I can't breathe. Alright, let's go. Like, one more time. Like... Yeah. Wait, you guys are way too early. Yeah. Let's talk, let's talk, keep this was the best waltz that you know I've seen, and I've seen a, a ton of waltzes. Like I've been part of so many quinces, but this is definitely something different. You know, we just brought something new to the table that no one has seen before. Hey. After every quinceanera, I try to make my waltz better than the last one. It needs to be badass, it needs to be cool, it needs to be different. I need more baddie. You're gonna get that. No, I need it now. This new song that was fresh, never taught before, love the beats, know the meaning of it. I felt so much inspired. Get five, four, three, beautiful. You guys ready? They've been calling me manager all day. You don't like the, the title? Yeah, but I'm not their manager. My expectation for these boys were, I'm not an AC boy today, but all I have to say to these boys is, guys, do not f embarrass me. <gasps> these guys f know you guys. This, my, whole, my whole table, I hope you guys, they're all like, oh, we're excited. Yeah, like, they know. They, they know, know you guys, guys and everybody know. in this building knows about you guys. The whole f building. He said you. And, and this is why he's not in the skin to guys. <laughs> Oh, okay. Oh my god, bye. Who taught you how to rock it that good? Natalie. Really? Natalie, yeah. Really? You think you're all that? Whoa. It was Natalie. It was Natalie. It was Natalie. Hey, this pretty girl, happens. pretty girl hey. walked like this. Hey. this. This is what happens when you give him the title manager. I heard that there was some rumors going around. Alfredo was saying I was butthurt. And what I have to say about that is if you didn't hear that from me, then you shouldn't be saying that I was butthurt and that I was quote unquote sad about it because I wasn't. <laughs> how do you how do you like feel about today? I don't know, I know it's like not your usual like like day in the kids, I guess. Like what's what's going through your head? Things with me and George have been so weird lately, like it's not us. I wanna clean the air. I chose AC fifteen because I know George from school. I really thought he was gonna be in my court. But why not? I don't think he deserves to be thrown in it. George or me? George or me? You. Sorry, George. 
Bye. So I think it was really important for me to like have a talk with George on like, hey, this is why things went this way. Like I don't want to sound like bad in a way, but I feel like I brought her towards you and like I feel like it was disrespectful in a way. All of this definitely has to like go back to auditions. After auditions, his confidence just went down. How are you gonna come in here and forget the whole dance on the spot? Like I reconsidered him joining AC Boys. I don't wanna talk about it. <laughs> no comment, no comment. I really don't wanna talk about it right now. You've been training with us forever and I was like, no, he's gonna literally like shock us and like Angelica was there and she wanted to see so bad. Like I just I just felt like I was let down. I needed you to learn your lesson through this quinta so then for whichever ones you get put in, like, you know, like, oh shit, like, I really have to make sure I... I just think you could have done it in a better way and not have to know that. I want to show him that I'm capable of so much because I feel like that's what he needs to see. We've grown together. I've seen you grow. I've seen your account grow. I've seen everything grow. And I'm happy for you. And I know you're happy for me. And I'm happy for you. And we're happy for each other. And we're like this. We're like this. But I just feel like you could have done it better. And... I don't know. I want you to know that, like, you're still on the team for a reason. Like, if I really thought that you were, like, not AC Boy material, you wouldn't have been on the team, but you're still on the team for a reason. So. <laughs> I definitely want to give George another chance with this upcoming client that we have. I want to throw him in as main and see how he does. You know, like I want him to re audition right here, you know, and he has one job. Prove me wrong. Guys, there's a surprise guest here. Hey guys, how are we? Hey guys. But the queen is here. Oh wait, it's me. <laughs> ah, that eight, huh? That eight? Did that eight? Okay, okay. okay. <laughs> I was walking in and I looked right at Fredo and I knew I shouldn't have looked at Fredo because damn, like this is really like the last time like my name's gonna get called in a quinceanera and like this is my last time walking, you know, to the dance floor like this, so. I'm watching the grand entrance and he's limping, barely walking and I'm like, Stressed. Like it's only a two-minute dance. Like you'll be fine, right? Like after that, you can cry, right? I really like having Angelo as my mate because, like, he dances good. Like he knows how to work with someone, like as a partner. At first I was nervous because I'm like, oh, I'm the main. It's a tough job because you literally have to be perfect. So you make your night perfect. Well, the first practice, he told us you had a boo. Yeah. Do you still have a boo right now? Mm. But he's not going to the party. Why? Mm. Is that a Then she said she don't like you. I think she does it a little. A better boo thing. Like that. Doesn't get jealous that much. I'm watching Bianca's Waltz and I'm just extremely proud. Extremely proud and happy and it was just so pretty to see like the boys grow onto this team and like get better at what they do, right? I was so happy, like I'm feeling so blessed, like watching them like, these are my boys, these are AC boys, like, it's so beautiful, they look so beautiful. And Bianca, I love the way Bianca's portraying herself as like a bad B, like just portraying herself as like, it's my quinceanera, like that's what a quinceanera needs to do, like, feel confident. <laughs> Thank you.
If we play it safe, it's we're just any other team. And I don't want to just be any other team. I want to be the team. Come on, baby, come on. My advance is happening right now, and my dress is really heavy. I don't know if we're going to be able to do the lift. These boys, I want to say a really big thank you, and I appreciate each and every one of them. And I want to tell you guys that I really love you guys, like, a lot. Like, you guys mean a lot to me. I'm a for sure like miss all of you guys, like our practices, like our talks. They bring like a joy to me, they're like really nice, like <sighs> I wanna say that I'll miss you guys a lot and I hope the best for you guys like in life. My voice is cracking. Damn, the fit, the fit. Where'd you get the shirt? Where'd you get the shirt? How much is the shirt? How much is the shirt? She said, I'm a how much we're, pants? At, we're, how at, much we're, we're at, we're at, we're at. 50? We're at, we're at, we're at. How much the boots? All right, how much your dance? Let's go. Y'all better get hyped up here. What? 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 Hey, 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 hey. Make your man, your man boobs bounce. Boom. I'm honestly scared for the lift in my baile sorpresa. Easy squeeze. Go for it. Nice. The first times we did it, I kind of messed up the ceiling in the studio. Yeah, boom, 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 boom. Hey, guys, let's go. It almost feels like we're part of the family at the end of the day, so it's really like, you know, emotional just like watching it and this one being the last one, it's really like a special thing. All my boys, like all the AC boys, like they did their job, the dance ate, they all had fun. My eyes were directed towards Bianca and Diego because Bianca, like, she's the center of attention. She's, like, the princess of the night. And Diego, on the other hand, like, this is his last quince with us. The quince was fun. Like, I enjoyed it. I try to do as much as I can. I really wish I did the iguana, but I couldn't. It is what it is. This quince was the best one ever. Everybody was dancing. Everybody was getting lit. It was fun working with Bianca. It was the best. I'm proud to say like that that was the thing that ended that chapter for me. I'm proud to show anyone that video. I'm proud to show. I'm proud to talk about it with anyone. I'm proud to, you know, bring up that moment because it was truly something that I'll remember forever. Being able to have people around me. Knowing that I'm helping someone else is just amazing. You should always try something new because you never know what's going to come out of it. And it just brought something that I never knew I needed. You know, being part of this like made me feel like I've done something good to help others. You know, it's just brought like a new, like a second family to me, honestly. I couldn't ask for more, to be honest. Things happen for a reason and this is something that I needed in my life. Bro, I'm gonna go to my car, because I need my botas. After the dance, everyone's hugging Diego, Diego's crying, and I'm like, I'm not gonna go. 
I'm gonna stay right here because <laughs> I'm gonna cry. And at some point I was like, I need to go talk to Diego and just like, you know, like tell him how I feel. Is it wet? Is it wet? <laughs> oh my gosh, I see you. I see you Friday, bro. I don't wanna cry. I <laughs> cry. We didn't have to say nothing. All it took was one hug. And we hugged and I know what it is. <laughs> I remember the day you came. Yeah. And it was just supposed to be like a trial. Uh -huh. Like literally if it were for that one kids, I don't think I've ever met you. <laughs> I'm crying. He brought up this one thing and like that just made me like I told him that like I'm so glad that like I met him because he's like the best friend that I lost because I did lose my best friend when I was in high school and I feel like my best friend sent me Diego because my best friend was all about like you know your business and like grow and like meet these wonderful people and one of one of those wonderful people was Diego like if you would have never come out and like your cousins continue to like we wouldn't even cross paths and you know what's so crazy? Like, it was like, because it was that one day I was at the studio. I was at the studio and Ernie told me about you. They're like, oh, like, you need to get this boy on your team. I'm just so proud of him. He's, he's an amazing person and I'm so excited to see what he does later on. You know my best friend? Mm -hmm. I never really like trusted anyone enough to like be able to call him my best friend, but you know, being able to grow with Alfredo and you know, having this like environment around me is just truly something that I would have like never expected to get.